Financial freedom, enabling lifestyle freedom, utilizing the principles of compounding and leverage according to Robert Kiyosaki's cash flow quadrant. Welcome, Daryl Lufton here. I look forward to connecting with you and helping you achieve your goals and dreams. At the age of 16, I began my working career as a mechanic. After completing my apprenticeship, I realized that being an employee and trading my time for money was not for me. At the age of 22, I pivoted to an alternative medicine practitioner career with big dreams and goals. In 1998, I became very unhappy with the financial rewards that my clinic was producing, and I read Robert Kiyosaki's best-selling book, Cash Flow Quadrant. I realized that I was still really just trading my time for money in my practice, just like an employee, and that I did not have a real business. That is the business that will run for you whether you're there or not, which is one of the two main keys of financial success according to Robert's book, Cashflow Quadrant. In 2005, I completed a postgraduate diploma in management studies, the first half of a Masters of Business Administration degree, an MBA at Waikato University. For a long time now, I've been looking for the ideal low barrier to entry, high income generating real business online that is affordable and doable for the average person. Patience paid off and I believe I've found it. It's called on passive. Why on passive? On passive truly is a fully automated online business that runs for you whether you're present or not after you set it up. Obviously, if you do some sharing, the more you will get out of on passive. On passive provides a full suite of above market value, f some free and some paid digital solutions to individuals as well as small and large enterprises. Disruptive physical products are also in development. In addition, I love that our mission is to serve and uplift humanity and that we are the correction for the corruption. We are here to help improve people's lives for the better. Ash Mufara, the CEO of On Passive, is in my opinion a brilliant businessman, pioneer, visionary, philanthropist, humanitarian leader, inspirer, coach and friend. What Ash has done with On Passive has never been done before. It's a new paradigm shift of business creation, development and management. I believe that what Marty DiGamo said is true, that on passive will be studied in business schools in the not too distant future as a revolutionary business model. And on passive will be life support for many struggling businesses. Ash Mufara has group consciousness as many of our other leaders have, often saying we are our brother's keeper, which is a hallmark of high developed souls from the research that I have done. He certainly is a very different CEO, not really a CEO, more a friend, mentor, coach, aspirer and visionary leader. With On Passive, I now have complete faith that my future is financially secure and that I will leave a legacy for my family that I would never have been able to have left before On Passive. I would love to show you the reality of On Passive, the huge income opportunity for us all, the positive impact we are having, the full potential of this disruptive groundbreaking project, which is more than a company, more than a movement, it is a revolution to uplift humanity. Okie dokie, hello everyone, how are you? Good to be here once again as always and today is Tuesday the 28th of November. Hope everybody is having a great day and uh, thank you to Marty and Robin. They've just finished. I hope you've had a chance to go and listen to them. Uh, some great information they had. Obviously, minus uh, good friend, Chris Johnson. He's under the weather at the moment, but he's resting and will certainly be back very, very shortly. Uh, before we get started, a uh, big happy birthday to um, uh, Sharon Quirk at the moment. Uh, she is the big 6-0 and over there in Alicante with Brian as well and a massive happy birthday to her for reaching a fantastic milestone I know how it is so uh, happy birthday to you uh, also what's going on today our Papa Africa Charles O'Song he is at the moment uh, in transit flying out to Africa doing a huge tour of the African continent at the moment about five months actually He's going to be over there. So if you are in Africa and you are in contact with Charles Osong, uh, get in contact with him because he might be passing your door. And he's got lots of places he's visiting. 
uh, to spread the word of on passive. So fantastic for him uh, for that. Uh, don't you worry, Marty. You didn't run late. In fact, you were perfectly on time. Uh, Marty, uh, I'll give you a call afterwards. Uh, just want to run something by you if that is OK. Uh, so, yeah, Charles is on his way to Africa uh, to spread the word of on passive for a five month period, like I said, and he is going to be meeting up with many, many founders. Uh, so if you are a founder in Africa, and I know there is literally thousands of you, get in contact with either your sponsor or Charles himself and ask him what his itinerary is. And I'm sure you'll be able to meet up with him along the way at some point. Uh, so that's fantastic news, Charles, uh, that you are able and are doing that uh, he's having a bizcation. Yep. Kind of like what I have, really. Uh, when I'm away, I'm never that far away from on passive, that's for sure. Okay, let's bring you up to date then. Uh, card payments. I know it's the hot topic at the moment, and I know that uh, some of you, not many of you, but some of you are still, still experiencing problems paying uh, at the moment. Now, I do know that it's working and I'm getting many, many reports of successful uh, payments for it. So whether it is being done uh, at certain times or in a controlled way, I'm not quite sure, to be honest. But I do know that people are uh, having the ability to pay. If you are getting any errors, uh, just try refreshing the pages, trying again in an hour's time, etc., and try changing the times of when you are uh, thinking of paying for your subscription. Just remember, there is a uh, admin fee from the merchant on this, averaging at twelve to thirteen dollars per transaction. I have heard of higher cases, but that is very rare, uh, to be honest. Um, when I activated a couple of accounts on Sunday, uh, mine were at $12, okay, uh, which is still fantastic, isn't it? I've got my accounts. Now all my accounts have been funded uh, and activated, which is exactly what I wanted to do. And with the discount that Ash gave us anyway of the $50, you know, I'm still exactly where I want to be and extremely happy to have activated those accounts. So hopefully you guys uh, will be able to do the same. Keep on trying if you're not. If you are a person that has paid for your account by cryptocurrency and a 24, 48-hour period has gone through and the funds have reached the end user, you can track this, by the way, um, on blockchain uh, to see that has been delivered. If you have notification of the delivery to on passive and O Connect is still not showing in your OES, then two things you need to do: uh, reach out to support with the blockchain blockchain ID number uh, and the verification of that. Plus, fill out the Google spreadsheet that uh, Marty. Uh, has up there in the update section of your O Founders back office. That is only for uh, the people who have been paying with cryptocurrency, and it's not going, it's not showing O Connect within their ecosystem. Okay, so for me, wonderful news always at the moment, and that is that we have the ability now to pay for OConnect. What does this mean in real terms? If you remember back um, from uh, a couple of weeks ago when we saw our CEO, the game plan is to open up the merchant so that we can get payments on the go. And then this next stage is to clear all of the pending withdrawals that are there at the moment starting with cryptocurrency first and then working their way through into the ones that I've requested to the bank. I'm pretty sure that when we hear from our CEO, which could be tomorrow, not promising that, but I do know he's been invited. So let, fingers crossed that we do see him tomorrow. I'm sure that when we do, he will update us on the process and how things are going as far as the merchant is concerned. Now, remember, 
Uh, DMCC is what is showing uh, on uh, the initial part of your payments. Remember as well, you can also print off the document uh, of proof of payment as well, directly off that first screen page. Uh, do I recommend you to do that? Yeah, why not? Uh, it's a hard copy. Uh, obviously, you've got the uh, proof within your payment of your bank or your card as well. But why not print it off? The um, ability to do it is there directly on your screen. So why not print it off whilst you have the chance? Um, yes, I think we'll be seeing him and then he will bring us right up to date, won't he, with where we are as far as the process is concerned. Going back to what I was saying with DMCC, uh, this is a free trade uh, place in Dubai. That is the name of the company. You can search it online. It gives you all the information about uh, what it is. Uh, pretty exciting stuff, I believe. Uh, reading in between the lines of what this is, this is part and parcel of the overall game plan of what OnPassive has, which is to have uh, their own payment processor. And obviously, you have to start somewhere. But uh, the merchant is in Mexico, and so it's getting diverted to Mexico and then back round again. All pretty normal stuff as far as internet is concerned. Uh, it's just what we are using as an interim at the moment, uh, what until we get our own processors, which is exactly where we want to be. Remember, Ash did say the three things uh, that we need to own the internet. One is the ecosystem. We've got that. It's over a year old now, and it's extremely stable. All works fantastically well, doesn't it? Uh, I haven't heard of any issues with that. Uh, the second one we need is to have complete control over the payment processes within our own um, ecosystem. And the last one, obviously, is that uh, data center and obviously complete control over hosting our own products and services within that data center, the verification, domain names and websites, all that is incorporated into the data center because that's what hosts it at the moment. We all know that we use AWS services, which is Amazon. And obviously, this is literally costing the company hundreds of thousands of dollars. And I do mean hundreds of thousands of dollars to have that hosting uh, with AWS services. Uh, so things are looking good, all moving smoothly. Uh, like I said, payments are there at the moment. And I'm sure that the withdrawal side of things will be coming along. I'll let Ash bring us up to date with all of those. Uh, he's the guy that knows and he will give us a much better idea of uh, when to expect it, how it's all processing and things like that. I'm only guessing, guys. Uh, obviously, until you hear it from Ash, uh, then we don't know. A couple of other things then. Uh, you will notice in the profile section, I did bring this up yesterday. Uh, in the prof profile section, underneath your name and the rest of it, and just above the alternative email, you will see in your ecosystem that they have put two other sections. Uh, they're not uh, clickable yet or filler outable, if that's a word, uh, of the name that shows on your national identity uh, card, whether that be a passport or an ID, but your national one, and also the date of birth that shows on your national ID. OK, uh, this is going to obviously this is part and parcel of the first process uh, of Overify. Uh, obviously, again, our CEO will give us more e details about that and when that's going to be live and when we have to fill these things out. I'm going to say this again. If you are one of the countries that, and you do not have a national ID card, passport or whatever it may be, do not stress. OK, there will be ways for you to verify. OK, this is just a generic uh, across the board part of the profile uh, that is going to be there for the majority. OK, and really, uh, that's what we have to work on at the moment is the majority and then the minor minority. There is going to be other methods for people who do not have that. So don't stress about it everybody will have the ability to be verified. Remember, O-Verify is free. 
for us uh, as on passive users uh, within the ecosystem, but it's also going to be a paid version from a business to a business point of view to be able to resell it to uh, other companies who need to use verification. And there is loads of them. How many times have you been online and you have had to verify who you are in one way, shape or form, whether it be in banking, whether it be even purchasing, that you have to do a verification process as, as part of their security. Big deal these days, isn't it? To prove who you are, uh, to prove that you are not a bot, to prove that you are who you say you are. Um, OK, that will be a service that you'll be able to resell to people. And obviously, if you resell it to a company yeah. or a business that they're going to use Overify for their personal use to verify uh, guests, clients and customers within their own business, you will get a commission. That is the beauty about on passive. That's what it's all about. We've said it from word go. Uh, whilst we were looking for early adopters of on passive to help us along the journey, we have always said from day one, we will be a customer based business. And this is exactly what we are. We are a customer based customer based business that sell digital products and services, plus a lot more now, obviously. Uh, but that is the meat and potato of our business you sell something you make a commission and then obviously ash is going to bring us up to date with other parts as well to make money through on passive i'm sure he will go into much more detail about uh bonuses he's talked a little bit about this that uh he wanted to let us know by the beginning of december uh again he will bring us up to date with all of those as well so I really believe that this week and next week are going to be two big weeks in on passive. Um, most weeks are pretty big at the moment. Um, in fact, for 360 tomorrow, I've actually had to start writing uh, on a daily basis what's been happening in on passive so that I don't forget. And uh, the list has been growing considerably uh, this week because there actually has been so much going on. Um, as far as on passive is concerned, and I didn't want to miss uh, anything so that when I do the recap tomorrow, I can bring you all up to date with what's going on. That's for sure. Um, what else have I got for you? Um, obviously, uh, the rate that I said about the charges, it is variable, guys. Don't know why it's so variable for different country. Uh, by country by country, but this is an external charge, nothing to do with on passive. OK, I'll reiterate that once again. The uh, service charge that you are getting when you are paying is nothing to do with on passive. It's all to do with the third party um, merchant that they are using at the moment. OK, and whether it's rate fluctuations, country fluctuations, I have no idea. But I do know that it's nothing to do with on passive. But like I said, we've had a discount uh, to be able to activate our accounts. So any charges, uh, as long as you're underneath that fifty dollars, you're singing and dancing, really, aren't we? You've got your cat. You've got yourself. Uh, uh, you've got yourself um, registered. The account is activated, and that is the main thing to do. Uh, isn't it as far as that is concerned so yeah lots of information to be able to come our way shortly obviously the pool of users that are there in onpassive.com we haven't had information about how that is going to be happening uh, but it is going to be happening so that is going to be coming as well our way and i'm sure again when we see our ceo he will be bringing us up to date with all of these things uh, like I said, he has been invited for tomorrow. Wouldn't be surprised if we see him. We didn't see him last week, but prior to that, we saw him five weeks in a row, I believe it was. Uh, so there's a huge chance that we'll see him tomorrow. And if not tomorrow, uh, <laughs> uh, he will be definitely calling an O-Connect meeting for all of us. That's for sure. Uh, not much else for you now. Uh, short and sweet from me today. Obviously, uh, I'll do a quick recap. Colonel Daniel Lee, thank you so much. My friend, for your super sticker, very, very kind of you. 
Um, obviously, tomorrow I'll do a little warm up and to bring you up to date with anything that uh, needs to be said prior to uh, 360. And then 360, unless things change, will be at 2 p.m. Eastern on O Connect. OK, uh, I will make sure uh, that it gets recorded and if able to and applicable to uh, have that recording available to people either as an unlisted uh, on YouTube or putting out onto YouTube. So I know that some of you missed last week's. Uh, so I will speak to Marty uh, about that to see the mate to make sure that uh, if you can't make uh 360 tomorrow it does get recorded especially if uh our ceo also if uh, the last thing then if you are a uh twitter or x user whichever you want to call it these days uh a nice little post uh came up about 20 minutes ago actually from our cmo mohammed nasal he posted out a little tweet uh today uh i'm sure that's getting shared all over social media at the moment as he says dropping his pen uh, so go and have a look at that. Uh, pretty cool. Uh, just a little uh, to, to let us know that he's still there and working behind the scenes, which is fantastic. Uh, so go and have a look at that. Apart from that, not much else I've got for you guys. Uh, I did have a look around. Uh, oh, yeah. One, a couple of things, actually, when I was looking around. Um, Web page, the new on passive web page. I noticed that the about us section has been revamped and it's another new one. Go and have a look at it. Uh, I really like this one. If you are wanting to explain what on passive is, it's a lot more organized and laid out now. Um, it's got some headers, okay, which are easily uh, readable. And then it goes into some pop ups uh, with a moving um, center part to it. Really like the about us section on the new website. Go and have a look at it, guys. It certainly is worth having a look at and it will give you a good idea. Uh, the other thing I'm just going to check now whilst I'm on here is to see if the links have been updated uh where are we yep yeah, we have a brand new uh link in the my link section uh link number 47 is there and that will be from last week's uh web page that is there now live uh so if you want to send that out to people that will be coded to you uh also i mean i i, I try and bring what i've noticed to the table for you uh i know it's not much of a big deal but I'm sure that the <laughs> media department do this on purpose just to see if I notice that it has done. But the login and register tabs at the top have been switched over and we have login first and registration second. And last week and actually for a long time, uh, it's been register first and then login second at the top header on the web page so uh i like to try and notice new stuff uh that's for sure uh so and if i do i obviously bring it to the table for you guys as well i have noticed one new thing in the ecosystem uh to do with the my user section uh, i can't bring you up to date with that just yet as i want to talk to marty just to clarify it uh, before I can bring it to you, uh, but uh, should be able to do that pretty, pretty uh, shortly, that's for sure. Anyway, that's it from me for today. I'm going to go over to the uh, chat area, say a few hellos. I've been looking for something like this for a long, long time. The journey to now has been a roller coaster ride but it taught me invaluable lessons, skills, and insights. After thousands of hours of research and experience and investing thousands of dollars in testing many opportunities, both online and offline, I can say that I know what to look for and what to avoid. On Passive has been getting better and better all the time and helping millions of people in over 150 countries around the planet. Most importantly, Unpassive is here to help us all succeed and is here to stay. 
Our mission is to serve and uplift humanity. We are the correction for the corruption. On Passive is a real company with a real CEO, with real staff, real products, which are all above market value. Many have never been seen before. We have real partners, real customers, real sales, real commissions, and real help to unlimited people around the world. On Passive will help you save money, save time, and be more efficient and effective. You get more and pay less with OnPassive. OnPassive is free to try and we have many free products that will be free forever. If it doesn't save you time and stress, then don't use it, but I'm sure that it will. You have nothing to lose and a lot to gain. If you like what you saw in this video, please subscribe to my channel, like the video and leave a comment. Click the link in the description below to join OnPassive free and take the tour and get in touch with me if you have any questions. If you would like to be an on passive affiliate reseller and get free traffic from the company with our efforts that create a traffic tank for the traffic rotator with my support, click become an affiliate at the top of your on passive ecosystem, read and sign the NDA. There's a video explanation of how to do this in the description below. Contact me with any questions you may have and I will reply immediately. My email is daryl at omail.ai, D-A-R-R-Y-L at O-M-A-I-L dot A-I. Thank you for watching. See you again soon. Love, peace and harmony for us all.